Hey guys, um, just out here messing around today. Got something quick for you. Um, we're actually, we've cut off the top two planks of the ramp, made it a little bit shorter, made the, uh, the takeoff angle a little bit different. So we're just changing up our uh, geometry of our ramp set up here. As you can see, I've got the top laying here cut off right beside it. Um, you can see it's a lot shorter. Because of the way it's set up now, I've had to increase the gap. Now we're about five and a half feet or so, give or take. Let's see. From the top of the wood to the top of the ramp, we're looking at about 65, 66 inches. I was right, roughly five and a half feet. Uh, so we're gonna get out here for a few minutes, just play on it, see how, how it uh, launches me, see how it feels, and uh, we'll go from there. Also, I got a little surprise for you guys at the end of this video, so stay tuned, I'll tell you about it. I'm gonna hit it with the same speed I normally hit it at, um, so you guys can kind of see the difference on distance versus height I've been getting. Uh, so we'll, we'll do a couple runs like that, maybe a couple runs of uh, trying to just gap it nicely. See what we come up with. Now that you got with seeing what that looks like, uh, regular speed. Let's just try to make it a nice clean gap and see if I can't land it uh, pretty smoothly. I don't know what kind of speed I'll need or, what it, or how much jumping force I'll need, but let's find out. All right, so figuring out the right amount of speed is a little difficult now. I'm just, I'm so used to the other way. So this is, uh, as you can see for those last two jumps, Eh, they're okay. They're not bad. The main reason I want to do this quick video today, um, a little bit just to do that because I'm out here playing. I've got something that works for you guys. It's probably going to be a lot more exciting. Uh, more of a videotography, film, filmography, whatever it is. Uh, edit. It's going to be a little bit more of an episode. I've been writing down a script and kind of the actions and things I want to go along with it. Got that in the works. It's just going to take, take some time to put that together. Stay tuned. It'll be out here soon. Let's go grab some beer real quick. Now that the ramps moved back and the geometry's changed, it's definitely more of a commitment requirement. Um, it's a lot of fun though, but you do have to commit or because there's a bigger gap. Um, today to close out the episode, we're enjoying a New Belgium American Haze Voodoo Ranger um, Hazy IPA. Fun fact from New Belgium is they started in Fort Collins, Colorado, and when they turned 21 years old, uh, they expanded to Asheville, North Carolina. So they now have two breweries, two brewery locations. Um, so that way they can share their beer on both both ends of the country. Thanks for riding with me guys uh, Stay tuned for a really cool episode coming out soon. We're gonna be starting filming hopefully this week or this weekend and we'll uh, We'll see what we can get together. Hopefully it'll come out Relatively quick so you won't have a long gap like you've had in some of these other videos, but um Again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll catch you guys next time